Are you numbing everyone? Num num. What do you say when you don't know what to say? That's the that's the topic for today, okay? Don't you usually talk about the weather? Oh, nice weather, right? I already did talk about the weather. I usually talk about poop. I poop before stream, by the way. Who asked? Well, <laughs> even if nobody asks, you will know. I poop before stream. It was a nice poop. I'd say a 6 out of 10 experience. Why is it only 6 out of 10? Because I feel like I didn't poop out everything. Ow! You know you know what I mean? You know you know that feeling when you feel like there's still some poops left? And you you wanna release everything but you didn't release everything? So it felt like that. It's like it seems like there's more, but they don't wanna come out yet. It's not their time yet. It's not the perfect time to come out yet. So that's my experience. 6 out of 10 poops. 6 out of 10 because 60 bowel ejection. Wow. <laughs> How about you? Did you poop today? Okay. Today's topic is what do you talk about when you don't know what to talk about? And did you poop today? Those are the topics. And today's question. Feel free to answer. I did poop today. Let's go! Hooray for a good bowel movement. You know what I mean? Gotta celebrate good bowel movement, you know? These days, it's kind of rare. With all the greasy food that everyone eats, holy moly. Stop gre eating greasy food. Only I am allowed to eat greasy food. I love greasy food though, holy shit. Mine was 11 out of 10 experience because blood was involved. <laughs> <gasps> you got hernia stuff? Wait, is it hernia when you have bloody poops? Maybe hernia is different. What do you call that when you have bloody poops? Is it hernia? No, it's like something else. Hemorrhoids, there you go! Sof is hemorrhoidal today, everyone. Announcement, Sof has hemorrhoids. It is beneficial to poop every day, that's true. Do not let your poop be backed up. Do not get constipation, it's bad. Why are you all exposing me? Well, you did say uh, there's blood involved, so that means you got hemorrhoids. Don't push yourself too hard, Soph. If the poop doesn't want to come out, don't push it out, okay? Do not force it. Poop is one of those activities that you shouldn't force. Because if you force it, um, you're gonna be really sweaty. Somebody gonna get hurt. If you force your poops, somebody's gonna get hurt. It's gonna be the skibby the toilet man. <laughs> Beating your ass up if you force your poops, okay? Trust me. I know this. I have first hand experience of this. One time I was trying to force my poop. It really didn't want to come out, it uh, skipped the toilet man, showed up. Beat my ass senseless. Oh, that was bad. What a bad experience. I would give that establishment uh, 2 out of 5 stars. Bad toilet. Hmm. Bad toilet manners. Do you need manners when you go to the toilet? <laughs> Probably, right? Wait. Okay, I have a question. You're a poopy head. No, I'm not. Can we spell it out? You're a poopy head. <laughs> On the topic of poops, I have a question. When you're in a room with someone else, or like when you're in a room and like the the toilet walls are kind of thin, or like they could hear you poop, do you do you give it your all when you poop? Or do you try to um, to lessen the sound of your pooping? Do you like um, 
try to suppress the sound of your farts when you know like someone else could hear you for example in a public toilet right like if there's a lot of stalls and you gotta poop real bad there's a lot of stalls and you know that the person next stall is gonna hear you fart and poop will you um try to lessen the sound or will you give it your best and just rip it out you know make everyone here in the whole of the establishment the whole establishment will hear you poop and fart at the same time which one do you do <laughs> in public i let it rip to assert dominance <laughs> let it rip to assert dominance yes you hate that <laughs> Imagine, imagine you're just trying to wash your hands and you hear somebody in the stalls like, like really badly, you know? Like it's really, really intense pooping session and you could hear it and you're just there standing trying to wash your hands like what the fuck is going on? You know that scene in like White Chicks where he really had to poop and it was so intense like... <laughs> I don't remember what he ate, but he had to poop in white cheeks. It was so bad. Something like that. Imagine hearing that in a public toilet. And you're just there trying to wash your hands. <laughs> Will you get scared? Will you think like, oh my god, this guy's asserting dominance. Holy shit. Poop check. Rom. Hello. Actually, apples are good for you. Hmm. If you have bad diary, applesauce helps calm it down mm. did you guys poop today yeah i was just asking that did you poop today Ron? okay Ron. if you if you have to poop in a public bathroom do you let it rip to assert dominance or do you use the butt silencer so no one can know that you are pooping everyone needs to know come on share your story don't be shy Depends on how badly I need to go. What if you really, 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 really have to go? Like, there's no time to go home. That's why you have to... That's why you decide to just let it all out in the public bathroom, you know? There's no time to go home. It's the only toilet available. You just got, like, a, three orders of Chipotle. Just down it down. Inhaled all of Chipotle. And you're like, oh, shit. I don't feel so good. And you gotta poop. Here you go. That's the that's the setting. I'm setting the scene right here. I make sure the door is locked. I try to go out of my way to not poop in public, but if I really have to, I lock the doors in the big bathroom and then I poop. <laughs> Just lock the main door in the bathroom even though it's public. Ah oh, yeah. Rom has a is is shy about his pooping habits. Mm. Do I rub the applesauce near the affected area? <laughs> yes. I have to let it rip. It's unhealthy for you. <laughs> I mean, though. No. I think I'll stay in that bathroom until everyone knows who heard is gone. <laughs> oh, everyone's so shy. I mean, my, my, when I have to do it, when I have to poop in a public bathroom, I use the butt silencer. I try to be quiet. I try to shush my uh, my pooping sounds. Like shush, shush. quiet, but hold. This is a stealth operation. <laughs> we need a silencer for this one. <laughs> a stealth operation, dude. I consider it a stealth operation of high importance. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Value absolute. What is a butt silencer? Oh, it's my hands. I just squeeze my cheeks so it doesn't make a lot of sound. <laughs> That's the bad side in Saram. Use toilet paper 100% until it's white. Okay. It's a stealth mission that even Batman can complete. Yes. It's a stealth mission. I mean, I would probably also do the same. Like you said. I'm gonna lock the the main door to the bathroom. If no one else is in the bathroom with me, I'm gonna lock the main door. I'm gonna make everyone wait outside. That sounds like an average Taco Bell. 
I haven't tried Taco Bell actually. There's I have seen exactly one Taco Bell in the Philippines. It's not really a big thing here. I have seen exactly one Taco Bell and I never tried it. Because they say it's not that good, so I didn't try it. Also, it's expensive here. I don't know why it's expensive here, but it's expensive. Do you guys ever wonder if Batman needs to shit while he's in a suit? What does he do? It's a big and heavy suit. Do people ever see Batman come out of the bathroom after shitting? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe there's like a small compartment in his bat suit for the poopies. He got a little, little plastic bag for his poopies. For his bat poopies. Maybe he doesn't shit in the public bathroom. He probably shits upside down like a real bat. There's a reason why he's called Batman, you know? BRB? Okay, okay. Or was Hans in the same bathroom with him? Mm, I think he just uh, shoots in public while flying. Or upside down, you know? That's my theory. How does Batman poop? Or maybe he has a toilet in his Batmobile. Or he he has a, a portable toilet from his um, utility belt. Because... He has a utility belt, right? Maybe he has like a toilet spray. Portable toilet spray. If you spray it, it's gonna... Uh, a whole ass toilet is gonna come out of the spray. You're familiar with the Batman sprays, right? Hmm. Does he carry toilet paper with him? Nah, I don't think he carries toilet paper with him. Or maybe it's in his utility belt. Who knows? He has toilet paper in his utility belt. It must be awkward to pull down your tights and hold your cape out of the way while trying to take a shit behind the dumpster and finish up before someone walks past. <laughs> yeah. Imagine your Joker just going about your day, then Batman flies over you and shits on you. <laughs> Uh, that's the real backstory of Joker. He was having a nice, wonderful day and then suddenly, out of nowhere... <laughs> Bat poop. Drops on his ice cream. Oh my god. What a horrible day. It was also a chocolate ice cream, so he could not distinguish which one is chocolate and which one is poop. He cannot, like, lick around the poop. He has to throw the whole ice cream away. So that was so sad. And that was why he became Joker. Okay. Did any of you watch the new Joker movie? They say it's bad. I don't know, though. I haven't seen it. The Joker movie was pretty good, but... I uh, don't think I'm gonna watch the new one. Wanna know why I've got these cars, bad man? <laughs> is the ending song? Ending song! This is the ending song! <laughs>